This space, uh, this building is an old Carnegie Library and it was built in 1905 and uh, as part of the Carnegie Libraries throughout the U.S. It became a museum space in the late 70s and has been ever since. It's a wonderful asset for a town the size of Talladega. It is, it is really something special. We have exhibits of regional and national acclaim. We do a lot of arts education, arts camps for kids. It's a center for the community to come together. This museum and art itself um, is, is everywhere in the culture, cultures here. Yes, it's not the first thing people think about, but if you go looking, you'll find that art is at the center of many things. Art is very vibrant and very alive in Alabama. I'm a native New Yorker. And in 2002, I had opportunity to visit Talladega. So I came during the um, spring race weekend. The race was certainly a cultural experience and I had fun and I'm now a NASCAR fan. But I was more amazed um, by the people. I've been in Talladega for 15 years. I've been the president of the Alabama Institute for Deaf and Blind for seven years. Over the last several years, it's been a joy to see the resurgence in this city. Over the last year, we developed an agricultural center because it allows our students to learn about farming and agriculture in a very hands-on way. We also have the Alabama Industries for the Blind. And that's a manufacturing program to provide um, important work um, for people who are blind and visually impaired. We serve individuals from zero years old to 100 years old here in Talladega and statewide. As a businessman, I take a look at Talladega and I see all types of opportunity. Since uh, 2016, we've started opening up some businesses here, more alone focusing on arts and giving people access to tools and spaces and things to help them with their, their business goals. We have about seven of those buildings right now. We have one building that um, uh, at one time was the post office here in Talladega. And so that building is now uh, Basel's Wings. But the reality is it's more than that, and it's not about the buildings at all. We've had people come from around the country just to come eat barbecue at a restaurant in a small building on the side of a historic square in Talladega. And I say opportunity because that's what comes to mind every time I hear Talladega. We are going through a renaissance. We're seeing a number of people, even since I've been back, a number of people returning, buying homes, restoring homes. And this Talladega community embraced us as a family and because of, of the support we felt, um, the transition was very, very easy. That's what I like about Talladega. Everybody works together and we all raise each other up. There's opportunity every turn. <laughs>